This is a complete set of all the Estes model rockets that I have at this time. I do have a couple of models that I have yet to put together, but this is the current listing that I have at, at this time. So I'm going to kind of step through what I have. My oldest rocket right here is the Alpha 3, which I have had basically since I was about 14 years old. And so it's been, I've had it since the late 80s and it's, I still fly it and it's still flying pretty well despite being scratched up. Then I got the Skyhawker, which was about 12 years ago. It's a little banged up, but I like flying that a lot. Then there's the Tigris. I was able to find this one, um, this Estes model exclusively only at Hobby Lobby. I saw it and I couldn't find it online, so I decided to buy it there. Then here on the launch pad right now is the Mini Honest John, uh, which I, I built probably about a month or so ago and I've flown it once. It uh, flies pretty well and I was able to get it back without a lot of scratches. Uh, this Riptide right here I bought as part of the uh, set, uh, which included the launch controller that you see here and the launch pad that the Honest John is on. And I did that just because I used to have a launch pad, but it wound up losing it in a couple of moves. So I decided to uh, buy it as part of a set. I've flown it once. Then I have is the, uh, the Duramax uh, that you see here that I uh, built some time ago and uh, flown it once on a, on a B4 motor and it flew very straight and true. And I was able to get it back without a problem. Then right here was a, a pre-built uh, the Blue Origin New Shepard rocket. Flown it once on a C6-3 motor and that flew it straight and got it back without a problem. This, um, These two rockets here I have not flown uh, yet, but uh, this one right here is, I've already had a previous video on this one, which is the Estes Stealth. It is a vintage model that I purchased online and it is, um, uh, it took a, a couple of weeks, a couple of days to build and paint and so forth. I'm planning on probably just putting this one on display as opposed to uh, flying it. And then last but not least, you see two of the same type here. This is the uh, Estes Scorpion. The one in the back was the original one I built when I was 14. I flew it only once in, in about 2005, but it got damaged on the landing, and so I wasn't able to fly it again. So I rebuilt the Scorpion rocket. Basically, what I had to do is the Estes Mongoose, which is the latest version of this rocket. I purchased an Estes Mongoose and uh, spray painted it and decaled it very similar to the Scorpion that I had before. I've yet to fly this. I'm planning on flying it on an A85 upper stage and a B60 lower stage. So those are the complete, complete list of rockets that I have at this time. I have several other ones, which is the, the, the Odyssey, the Interceptor, and the uh, Zirconian Cruiser that I'm planning on building. And I also have a Starship Enterprise model that I won from an Estes uh, um, contest that I had online and so I've yet to put that together that's going to be really interesting to do so that's the current list of rockets that I have at this time